This is Cynthia. I'm attempting to record another video based on my recent purchases. I ask you in advance to please bear with me. I don't have a tripod and I'm doing this through my cell phone. But I'm really excited about some of the things I have and I really wanted to share my thoughts and opinions with you and the products I purchased. First of all, I would like to do a shout out to two of my favorite YouTubers. One is Sarah Martinez. Sarah has been like a rock to me in my life. Um, I've gone through some pretty traumatic things and she just always seems to be so kind and humble and caring and thoughtful. And I love her and I really hope uh, those of you that see um, my video for whatever it's worth that you also reflect on or be able to review Sarah's reviews um, on journaling and her covers and she was the inspiration for the cover you see here right now which I'll talk about in a minute um, but I also want to do a shout out uh, to Amy Graham the badass Bakery. I have been uh, watching her for some time now and again, she's another one that, um, although she does uh, a lot of reviews on her covers and books, she also has a lot of inspirational information that she tends to um, teach us um, and how we can be more involved in taking from what she delivers in her message and apply them in our own lives. But I appreciate both these women with all my heart. Um, and um, thank you. Thank you to both Amy Graham, the Badass Bakery, and Sarah Martinez. So the book you are seeing now is one that I re recently purchased from a gal um, from Yanni. I hope I pronounced that right, Yanni. If I did it, my advance apologies. Um, she is Eberhart Studios. Uh, this is the back. That is her maker stamp. And um, this is the B6 Slim. I had originally saw this uh, style and design um, on Sarah's uh, video, Sarah Martinez video. And she has one exactly like this in this exact leather. The only thing that I did was I changed it around a little bit. And um, it this came with uh, Yanni's designer um, with her signature pocket on the front. And on the inside, I requested these. They're almost like uh, little writing boards. Um, and that is the front and the back. Sorry, I have the book in there, so I'm going to do the best I can. Um, and this, I, I can't tell you, I am, I'm just so elated. I'm just excited. Um, Yanni did such a, a nice, nice job. Look at that stitching. It is just absolutely gorgeous. And um, she, um, I requested the same leather inside and out. And just, I, I couldn't be more happy. Um, this is my very first B6 Slim. Um, I had originally had purchased um, the um, NAMI. Uh, this this one, the Nami Cafe notebook, and this I that's what I wanted the cover for. Um, as you guys may notice, uh, I wasn't paying a lot of attention, and uh, unfortunately, everything's upside down in the book. But uh, I don't mind. Um, so this is basically what I'm doing. I you know I have my signature page in the front. And then um, I've been washi taping each page as I go. The other side, I do not. Um, and um, 
I have uh, this as a writing board. This is just an idea, but I actually have, um, I love antiquing, and I found this picture in a antique store, and I actually use it as a writing board, and it fits perfectly on the pages of this NAMI notebook. So, um, and basically, uh, that's what I'm doing. Um, I think the only disappointing thing, um, if I had to do it over, was um, I, I didn't realize how thin these pages were. And I tend to write uh, a bit heavy-handed. And um, if you put washi tape on the edge like I've been doing, you got to get it right the first time. Because um, it, it's just... I have this fear of ripping these pages, they're so thin, but uh, so far so good. And um, you get this with it, this blotting page. Um, but um, again, um, this is my B6 Slam by Everheart Studios. And I, huge, huge shout out. Um, oh, and then this is just another um, antique um, picture I got that I just put in the front here just to have something to decorate for now and um, so that is that now in saying that I'm, I want to just bring up a couple more uh, uh, shout outs uh, before I get to a couple things that I wasn't real happy with um, and that is um, I um, purchased from um, these are from a uh, journal this now and what these are here my apologies you guys um, I love these I absolutely love these um, she I bought these over Christmas um, if you guys want to see more I'm, I'm not <laughs> like a big artist uh, but she has like tutorials on there. Um, okay, so this is like the Pegasus. Um, this is uh, the Grome, Gromy, Grome Home. Um, this is um, Galaxy, something to do with the Galaxy. And you can find these all on our pages. Um, this is uh, like the brain dump one. Okay. And uh, this is uh, one of the um, alphabet ones. She's got several. This is just the one I picked. Um, yes, and this is the, the journey. I love travel. Thought of it, everything. So I'll find a way to journal those. Um, this is, um, uh, my Wisconsin. I, I am from Wisconsin, so that represents our state of Wisconsin, but she has all the other states as well. Um, this is for bills, bills and expenses, and this is weather, weather related. So those are the ones that I purchased. And if you spend $25 or more, you get this free tin. And it fits them perfectly. So, they all just fit in here. There we go. So, so I will use them to journal. Um, and I had asked which pencils she recommends. If you watch her tutorials, she uses these uh, Faber-Castell pencils. Um, I found uh, you can get them on Amazon. You can search them through YouTube, and I believe even Walmart sells them. They're like 50-some dollars through Walmart. Um, and what I did was I um, actually found a store um, a uh, artist store uh, in my state in, in my city um, that sold them and I paid like $54 for the set and here they are um, you get 36 pencils in the set 
So again, I'm not an artist, but she sure makes it look easy when she does her tutorials, and I want to give it a fair shake. Um, but I do like coloring and color books and things like that. So um, I just wanted to show that to you guys. Okay, there's that. Um, I had also, if you purchase that, I would recommend purchasing the, the Faber-Castell. Um, it's their, um, their pencil sharpener their pencil sharpener uh, because these weren't cheap pencils I just wanted to have the right tools for using um, those pencils okay um, so now I I want to just get into a little bit of um, I had done a uh, second purchase with uh, with NAMI and um, I'm not going to um, this is my personal opinion only. I'm not going to dirty mouth this company, um, but I do want everybody to um, know uh, my experience, and then, of course, you make the decision that's right for you. Uh, after I had purchased uh, the NAMI Cafe notebook, um, I wanted the plastic cover. Uh, so that was the first thing I wanted, and I did, in fact, order it, um, but um, it, it the thing, uh, it fits uh, the cover, uh, the jacket cover, very nice. But when I received it, if you can see this, this is just horribly ripply. And um, it just, you know, um, I was just very disappointed. And it buckled the cover. And I will not be keeping this, unfortunately. It just, it, um, I was actually hoping to fit this in my, um, my B6 Slim, um, but uh, it didn't fit anyway. And um, so I'm just not quite sure. I, I, I have to say, despite my feeling on some of this stuff, um, he did reimburse my order, uh, which I appreciated, but um, it was, just too bad that it came in like that. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do at this point. Um, the other thing, I, a couple other things I had ordered, um, and I won't be keeping these because I have no use for them. Um, this here um, was the little plastic ruler um, that he offers. Um, it was only a couple dollars, but I'm so sorry. <laughs> Just bear with me. Um, this was only a couple dollars. Um, but unfortunately, I misunderstood. Um, I was hoping that uh, this, uh, although it, it has centimeters, I was hoping that, for whatever reason, I, I was hoping that it came in inches as well. And apparently, it's not. Um, and I wouldn't even, because um, I'm a U.S. citizen, I just never, ever in my life used centimeters. And um, so this this isn't going to work for me either. Um, it's, you know, might be good for uh, tape, but um, again, I, I have no further use for this because um, I need it in inches. Um, but it was, um, it's just... A cheap plastic it's not as heavy as I thought it was going to be but again so it was that um, and the other thing I purchased was um, these um, rubber bands um, now in saying that again I just want to reiterate that everything here was only a couple bucks um, but um, I was just disappointed because my understanding was that they were a little bit better than a thick rubber band. But unfortunately, that is all they are, is just a very um, thick, there you go. Just, oops, <laughs> that hair on it, I'm so sorry. Um, it's just a, a thick rubber band. So I'm not sure you can't find something like this in, in a hardware store or a, a office supply store if you want something like this and but I have to say the one thing that I ordered that I absolutely loved was these clips 
um, and they come in this bag and you get uh, six of them in a package and um, they're just these itty bitty clips and um, so again um, I believe these were worth you know if if you want to order the cafe notebook um, I I know it, you just you won't be disappointed in these um, I would recommend ordering these these are nice they're nice and tiny and um, again you get six of them and that was definitely worth it so um, that is my review for now I just wanted to try and, and do this again to give you guys um, my thoughts on my very first B6 Slim and more than likely my only B6 Slim. Um, and that's fine. Uh, but I, I just absolutely love what Yanni did. Um, she's very easy to work with. She communicates well. Um, she actually repeats back what she said, um, so there's no misunderstandings, um, and I just love my Coco, um, that's what I named my book, Coco, and, um, so if you have any other questions, concerns, or anything of the sort, this is just an uh, idea how I decorate my pages before I start writing. A little bit of washi, a little bit of stickers, you know. Um, but I would recommend getting some kind of writing board or uh, something so you have some support on the pages because they are so thin. Um, and again, thank you for watching. And if you have any questions, comments, um, please be positive. And thank you for your time. Bye.